Hey guys, what's up? Uh, today here I got a review of the my custom 150 scale uh, welder trailer. Um, you don't really see these a lot. I um, was just really bored and wanted to do a custom, and I uh, seen this in the back of my service truck. I uh, seen this here in the back of my service truck, and I was wondering um, like if they have that in real life. So I looked it up, and this is a copy of one I seen. Uh, I'll also be throwing in a review of this pickup. I mean, it's your standard F-250, but other than that, I mean, I added a few things to it, unlike the other ones. So I figured I might as well pull, kill two birds with one stone with this video. But anyway, to get started in the review, uh, I'm going to start off with the pickup. Um, not much, just um, added on a visor, a, um, a custom cab lights off of uh, semi-trucks. Um... A uh, headache rack from Shapeways, toolbox, you know, your standard uh, stuff. Um, other than that, though, um, also custom built this here. Uh, the diesel tank. But other than that, that's really it for the pickup. Um, this review isn't for the pickup, it's for the welder trailer. I'll move that out of the way. And um, moving the trailer in. Um, here's the welder trailer. Uh, didn't take me too long to build it. But, uh, it's a welder that I got off the back of my first gear service truck. Um, all this is built out of styrene, except for the fenders that's, uh, sheet metal. But, um, it's painted silver, as you can obviously see. Um, it's a diesel, um, I think it's diesel-powered, uh, uh, welder. I think it's a Lincoln Electric. I'm not entirely sure I'm not into welding, but maybe one of you guys are and can help me help me out in the comment section below but other than that um added on tail lights a, a license plate things like that um by the time i was done with this there was too much weight in the back so it kept doing that so i added on a little die cast uh counterweights and then under there's a little different scale axle from a semi but other than that that's pretty much it for this i mean not much to it um um yeah I'll bring this back into view uh, if I can. We'll see here in a second. Okay. This is not one to work. Okay. Uh, as you can see, it does work with the panel hitch, just sometimes it wants to be stubborn. But anyway, um, that's the whole setup. That's my little welder pickup. Um, if any of you know what else I need to add to make this more realistic, uh, please leave a comment in the, in the comment section below. Um, just uh, going to show a few other things I custom built. I custom built this little chainsaw, you know, just because I, I had one before, but uh, I kind of uh, missed it, and um, I lost it, and so I figured I might as well make a better one out of styrene and this little uh, canister for um, chainsaw mix. But other than that, that's pretty much it for this video. Um... As you can see, just your standard welder trailer. Look it up on Google. You'll find a ton of them. But anyway, um, your standard F-250, like what I said. Um, other than that, oh, I have a um, package coming. Or I got a model coming either the uh, July 27th or August 17th. I'm not entirely sure. But um, other than that... Um, I uh, got, I bought a, I finally bought a Komatsu PC88. I negotiated with the guy and bought it for a really good price. Um, but anyway, I might do an unboxing of that. I might not. It depends if I can remember to grab my uh, camera in time. But um, other than that, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.